So I want to talk a little bit about the feeder chain. Number one, the length. The longer that I make the feeder chain, the closer it is to the cross auger on the corn head and also on the bean platform. And therefore, during the handoff from the auger to the feeder chain, I close down that distance so I can grab more material and I get less congestion and less regurgitation of material that boils during that handoff. The second thing is the speed of the feeder chain. The green combine, this is one of the features. I always talk about certain combines have great features that I love and others that I don't. I love the green combine because I can independently adjust feeder chain speed and corn head speed will remain the same. Therefore, during that handoff, if I'm getting a lot of congestion, I can speed up the feeder chain to pull those ears away from the auger and it'll stop the boiling. In the old days with the older green combines, we used to always see a lot of ear tossing uh, and it's it just simply the pile of ears got too high during handoff and then the auger would, flighting would just grab that ear and flip it out onto the ground. On a red combine though, feeder chain speed and corn head speed are one and the same. You slow the head down, you slow the feeder chain down and we get a little bit more boiling, especially on the newer flagship combines.